I got this laptop back and the, the battery symbol is on all the time, but uh, I could not get it to start up. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this apart and then I'm gonna unplug the battery and then just plug the power cord in and see if I can get it to boot up. Uh, all you need is a Phillips head Okay, so the four, four screws there all come out. These four here do not. They actually stay in. And then I'll use just a plastic pry tool. There's a couple clips here and here, I believe. Okay, so for the battery removal, all we're going to need to do is um, you know, pull this cord up, power cable, it's got adhesive on it, it's stuck down, and there's a little right here, this slides back, you can use a rubber pry tool or a plastic pry tool. You would like to and then there are four screws up top here that hold these in these are all Phillips head as well This just slides up and out. And then you're going to have to keep this cable because the new battery most likely will not come with one. It's also got adhesive on the back. Just gonna pry up from the back on that, just like that. Okay, now that the battery is removed, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the power cord, plug this in, see if it'll power up. Okay, so it's powered back up. I'm gonna shut her down. And then we'll put a new battery in. The first thing I always try on these is to take the battery out, plug it into power, see if it'll start up. And there's a pretty good chance it's just a bad battery. So I ended up just buying a genuine Dell battery. This was actually refurbished by Dell, but the old battery um, does not look like it's necessarily OEM, uh, which I find interesting. So we're just gonna get that cable, 
clamp that back down. Remember, it pushes down in there. Replace that. Make sure the adhesive is stuck on the battery well. And then this guy's just going to slide back down in. I go ahead and plug the the power back in before you press the adhesive down on the top of the cable. You'll feel it click. And this guy is actually supposed to be over the top of there. Not 100% necessary, but I find it interesting it was up there. All right, so we're gonna take our silver Phillips head screws and put these four back in. It's gotta slide in that way first and then clip it all in.